tip that's basically what we do when we swordfish we let it down thousands of feet and just watch the rod tip so yeah we're watching the rod tip right now we already got some action on it you don't look, look, look. Oh. Watch. yep look, yep look. yep I ain't even gonna really wait for the yeah just you want to wait for that good bubble good big nibble he's playing with it sometimes they whack the, the weight their bill a little bit which good. might look like a bite or they might even whack the bait a little bit with their bill. All we're doing is watching the rod tip. And it's Memorial Day. Happy Memorial Day, everyone. The swordfish bite has been really good lately, so that's what we decided to do today. I have not bait Maybe. It's so interesting, swordfishing. It's such a different type of fishing than I feel like what people normally think of when they think of fishing. Cause it can get pretty boring just watching the rod tip. But it's so exciting when you do get a bite. We have a Shimano Tiagra uh, 80 wide. Yeah, it's an 80 wide and no electric reels. We're doing this all by hand as usual, which makes it a lot more challenging. So I'm just gonna keep watching this rod tip and hopefully we'll give you an update with the fish on the end of the line pretty soon. Here. We'll see. We sat here a little bit longer and watched the rod tip a little bit more. Nothing happened. So we decided to reel up the bait and I reeled it up all the way by myself. It was really hard. Our bait definitely got hit because look. Grab this. I'll use this to grab it. Look at this. Half the squid is gone. We had a whole squid on there. So we're gonna re- Lewis, uh, while I was reeling up the... Our fish is right past 400 right now. While I was reeling up this, the bait, Lewis was rigging another one up. So we're gonna do a, new, a whole fresh new one. And... Yeah, we've been just catching Radio. up right now. Guys I guess it went down to about 600. I think there's two right other boats hooked up now. on swordfish right now. Get the squid down right now. Hopefully I can give me one. We're gonna, we're debating on whether or not we're gonna- one kill fish and I'm going home. Okay. <laughs> so we're debating on whether or not we're gonna switch locations, but it doesn't matter. We're gonna keep, keep fishing. It's still early in the morning. Just updating you on what's going on. We got whacked. And you're gonna go hook up Greg and Curtis? you know you're hooked up to a fish. Bent rod. Lewis on the reel. Alright, put it in the... Woo-hoo! You want some bait? <laughs> oh, wait, I'll wait. Oh my god. Right now, I can't tell if it's a swordfish or not. We're in, you know... It just feels big, whatever it it's, is. Yeah, it's, there's something heavy on the end, but we just don't know what. All right, this is just the beginning. Tell them with so I'm assuming, oh no, no, we gotta wait. We gotta wait. 
You know what? I don't like to talk. Don't I don't like to talk on the radio. Don't even tell them till the fish is in the boat. That's what I like to do. We're not gonna get on the radio like, oh, we're, we're hooked up. We got a big one hooked in the booty hole. Based on Might have to straighten previous... the motor and put it in gear. All right, straighten the motor. Based on previous experience, I feel like we might end up fighting this fish for at least an hour and a half, two hours maybe. So I'm not gonna film that whole time. My battery's gonna run out and it's gonna be boring. It's gonna be a lot of footage to edit of just, you know, the same stuff. But uh, hopefully we can keep this fish on, land it, find out what it is. Hopefully it's a sword fish. Thank you. It's in gear. Alright. I'm turning the GoPro off now. I'm on the fish now. Me on the fish now. Turn the wheel back to the right side. Okay. There you go. It gives the motor a little bit more throttle. Right. Yep. Right. Right, right, <laughs> reel him, babe, reel him. I'm slowed down so you can try to turn. Should be close to the weight. Oh, you ready? It's three different times. 
me a little. Real, real. I'm backing up. Okay. I can't. That one's gonna have some scars on its face for damn sure. The crazy part of this, my squid looks brand new. Didn't even phase it. Look, oh, yeah. this, put the rod. Oh, they can do that. I think you might have got one bite and you pull it up and it looks like it went through a meat grinder. Yeah, it's like Freddy Krueger tried to finger hug it. Try to keep it tight. Oh! oh my God.